Hello everyone, my name is Finmer and this is Star Sector Whiskey Tango. So Whiskey Tango's primary objective is going to be to colonize as many systems as possible that we do not have commissions with. So that means we're not going to be we're not going to be colonizing any hegemony stage systems aside from maybe one before we renounce our our uh, commission with the hegemony. So the first thing we're going to do is swap these two because I didn't know why they're set like that. And then let's go over here to see what we can do for our ships to make them just a little bit better. So let's see. Let's refit our wolf as soon as we can. And what can we put on you? They have lots of IR lasers and they have lots of harpoons. Okay, I have an idea. It's a terrible idea. You're going to think I'm crazy. But I can tell you, I'm not. I'm not crazy. I swear. Probably. Maybe. Let's hope. So let's go ahead and put those on there and um, mining blaster. This thing is a complete disaster already. Let's go ahead and uh, max out all the vents we can and what can we do here? Alright, so we have those IR lasers. Yeah, seems fine. Seems awful. Let's go with it. Let's put um, harpoons on you as well. Now well, let's put annihilators on you. That'll do the trick, I think. And what else can we do? Sounds good. So let's make those work and yeah, good enough. So what can we do? What else can we do here? Uh, not much. So let's go ahead and okay, we'll find that later. Let's let's go ahead and uh, yeah, let's see what we can buy. Okay, we can buy a Tarsus. We can buy buffalo. I mean, it's the best. It's the best thing we can buy right now. We need something to carry all our carry all our loot. So let's do that. I have lots of nice stuff here right now. I think. Yeah. So we're going to be slumming it out as much as we can this playthrough. So we will most likely be uh, living very cheaply. Let's see, what can we do here? We need to refit you. Let's give you all the capacitors. And, oh, he doesn't have shields. Well. It'll increase his speed, right? No, that's military subsystems that does that. Uh, good enough, I guess. All right, so. Let's go back, let's repair our ships, and let's go looking for some people to fight. Ah! He's coming for me. He's not, I'm not going to let him catch me. Screw that. Stay away from me. No, you can't touch me down there. That's my no-no square. <laughs> Alright. Let's. Jeez, he's still after me. <laughs> okay. Um, well, he still wants to... Oh, oh, oh. He still wants to get me. Oh, he's pursuing the pirate scout. Well then. Just head over here to Hegemony Daddy. Cause I want to get some of that get some of that sweet, sweet pirate scout as well. So, uh yeah, they're running away, right? So let's just have them fight. So they killed okay, they all died. I like it. Let's take it. Thanks, um, Hegemony Daddy. Let's salvage this, and I know they really wanted to talk to us. So uh, we'll just be the ultimate little simp and uh, and just uh, you know obey the obey what uh, Hegemony says. Wait, I don't think we actually got our commission yet. So let's head back to Jangala, where we will go and get commissioned. Yes, run for your lives. I already lured somebody over to you. Now I can do all the underhanded trading. Alright. So now we have accepted hegemony over our hege hegemony overlords. Let's see what we can do. Alright. So he wants to play, does he? Let's let's fight. 
Let's go ahead and kill him. All right, let's see how well these terrible ships do with my uh, wolf that probably has no reason to exist. Okay, let's go after you. And uh, I think I my strategy will be just to stay as close as I can. He doesn't have shields, does he? Well then, let's uh, take care of him then. Hello, friend. Goodbye, friend. Alright, let's run away. We can't vent, so we're going to just run away, like the cowards we are. And then we're going to close on him and kill him. So let's switch to our mining blaster. And let's just slowly take him down. Alright, let's bring our shields back up. And let's get him. Excellent. We did it. He died. Ah, very nice. We'll, uh, we'll, well, we won't have enough crew to, to deal with it. But, um, whatever. We'll, we'll take it for now. And we will mothball it. Let's go to fleets. Let's mothball you. And then let's. Oh no! We can't salvage anything, so let's pull, run our way back to Jangala. Back to Jangala. Where we can hopefully uh, have Daddy Hegemony repair our ships for us. And uh, yeah, there we go. So, we are going to need some more crew. Wait. We are going to need more crew of turn. Yes. So we are going to need more crew now. We need 69. Nice. Let's go up to 80 crew. No, no. Let's do it on the black market. So we're going to go up to 80 crew. There we go. And let's just go ahead and sell these uh, metals while we're at it. So what else can we pick up? Ooh, expanded missile racks, you say. I like it. Uh, converted hangar, eh? Well... Ah, we can't take it. Last. Let's go and hunt more pirates then. Let's repair our ships, and I can level up. So, what are we going to do here? Recovered ships, hull armor, faster ship repairs, hull deployment cost replies to maintenance cost. Our ships are probably going to get really jacked up because we're not going to want to buy new ships. So what can we do here? We will eventually like the next level of that. And we will like the next levels of that too. Because it lets us get more ships. But um, let's go with that so it costs us less to use recovered ships. And let, actually, let's, let, let's look at um, you because you're probably super jacked up. Um, medium ballistic. What can we put on you? Uh, heavy auto cannon. We want you to stay at range. So, how far range is that? 800, 700. I don't think we can afford this, can we? It's 12,000, so we can do that. Small ballistic. Um, yes, yeah, sure. Let's do light machine gun, and then over here, these. Uh, we can't afford any... Oh, hello. Right, let's strip it. Let's do a heavy auto cannon. Let's do... Oh, well, you're cheaper, so we're going to do that instead. And you don't have shields, so we're just going to max out vents and hope for the best. But then we're going to... Auxiliary thrusters, so you turn faster. And. Hmm. I guess we'll go with reinforced bulkheads. What else can we do here? Um. Is this civilian grade? 
Not on sea civilian grade. So let's go with expended cargo holds and uh, blast doors. Because open the blast doors. So. Additional berthing. That would give us more people, right? Yeah. Uh, what can we do with that? Uh, sounds good. Uh, gotcha. There we go. So this piece of crap is still... Yeah, let's adjust the weapon groups. Good enough. Now this piece of crap, it um, has good enough flux dissipation to just fire forever. So let's go back here and let's put that over there. That piece of garbage is probably going to get blown up the moment somebody sneezes on it. So can we hire an officer? Uh, yes. What can you do? You're steady. We can't afford you. So, uh, bye. Alright, let's go and fight some more pirates. Let's go over to whatever this is called. Who cares what they're named? And let's announce our presence. And our, our, our sonar pitches, hey, douchebags! Let's go, let's go kill this guy. Let's watch. We'll get there and then we'll be like, no, actually. Alright, come on, douchebag. Get over here. Douchebags! We're coming for you. And I'm gonna get you. Oh no! Whatever shall we do? He seems to be running away from us. And we're not big enough to really catch him easily. Oh man. Did you see that? He tried to do that whole juke. And uh, well, it didn't work out for him. Let's... can we sustain catch him? I think we're too... I think we're too big to do that. I mean, I think we're too small to do that properly. Can we do it? We did it! Excellent. Let's go ahead and move to engage. And let's send everybody in. Per usual. And, uh, alright, let's do it. They will not escape us. Oh, he has Reapers. He's dangerous. He could actually kill us. Unless we stay way too close to him, though. And then he can't do anything. Hey, there we go. Excellent. Very nice. Don't, as long as I don't get hit by my own... Dead. As long as I don't get hit by my own torpedoes. My own missiles. Where are you? There you are. Hello, friend. I have bad news. That bad news is this. I have six harpoons. The other bad news is that um, I'm absolutely nuts. Alright, there we go. Fantastic. Okay, so let's pick through the wreckage. We can take all this stuff. And we just got a nice payday from the hegemony in uh, two ways. Alright, douchebags! Alright, unfortunately we don't see any douchebags. Maybe there will be douchebag. Oh, we, we leveled up. Excellent. So we leveled up twice, no less. Hmm. Very nice. So what can we do here? Well, we could get lots of armor damage back, which will be huge if we're using hegemony ships. So, because hegemony ships are mostly just armor. Okay, so we just did our ping again. Come on, guys. You know what our ping sounds like, right? Go ahead and put it in the comments below. All right, so let's get away from him before they decide to unleash some fleets that we don't want to fight. And if we can, we might want to make a patrol want to come after us so we can lead them over to the other jump point over there. What in the world? Was there something red over here? That wouldn't make any sense. There's something. Oh, okay. It's, it's just the center of that. Who cares? So let's go over to this Place. This friend's jump point, and maybe, just maybe, we will find something over there that is good for us to hunt down and murderize. And, ah! What are you? Oh. Whew. Douchebags! Oh no. Oh no. Oh no, 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 no. Alright, your friends seem to abandon you. Let's go. It's, it's, uh, let's party. Let's have our 
um, minions come in. And let's go and hunt us some enemies, shall we? Oh, look, it's one of you. Oh, and it's another wolf. What do you know? Hello, fool. How are you? We're going to enjoy killing you. And that other wolf, he has hammers. So that could be dangerous. <laughs> nice. Let's go ahead and wait for our flux to vent, and then let's do it again. You don't expect me to play fair, do you? What do you think this is? I'm going to have to do for that, right? I'm going to have to kill you. You douchebag. Excellent. Kill him. Kill him, indeed. Uh, there we go. That's the stuff. Let's go and murder you. We are out of harpoons, unfortunately. That means we'll have to kill you the good old-fashioned way. Your guns are scary. They make a loud noise. But you know what? Ah! Mine are better. Mine make a scarier loud noise. Come on, let's do this. And... Come on, come on, come on. Come on. Ah! Let's just keep shooting him, shall we? There's nothing you can do to escape. Make all your base all belong to us. Damn it. You fool! <laughs> okay, where is the other? Where are the other ones? They're up there! Oh man. Oh, they're dead. No, they're not. Let's go kill them. Let's hunt them down. Let's give them no quarter. Unless they want to switch sides, at which point, hey, you know, we're always looking for new employees. The whiskey, the uh, whiskey th uh, tango club needs more employees. Let's go chase him down. Not let him escape. There is no escape. Dust. All right. Oh no, you poor person. Let's go ahead and claim victory. I think one of our ships got blown up. Oh no, what a, can we ever do? We need all these new employees to to man this these new ships of ours. Let's go to fleet. Let's mothball you, and mothball you, and mothball you, and ah, excellent. Yes, that's fine. Let's run for our lives, because their friend's probably coming for us. Ah, their friend is coming for us. <laughs> no, no. All right, so let's go to Jangadla and uh, see what we can do over there. So we have lots of new employees who need uh, jobs. And we are perfectly happy giving them lots of jobs. So we have lots of demods, so we might as well just uh, capital, we might as well just lean into having lots and lots of demods and saving us a lot of money. Yes, you can scan us, that's fine. We, we, uh, we, guard, we gain these ships completely legally uh, no question about that, officer. And uh, let's hire a lot of idiots. I mean, crew members. So, let's see. How many do we need? About 100 or so. Let's just hire... Eh, let's just hire, uh, you know, some people. And that should do the trick. Cool. Now, can we 
actually repair our ships. Yes, we have enough. But we're going to need to buy some more supplies. Luckily, we have lots of money. Sort of. Not really. But hey, what you going to do, right? Let's go and get 100 supplies. Can we afford this? We can! Excellent! Wonderful! Wunderbar! Let's go and now start outfitting things. So, what can we do with you? I'm going to call this... Um, I'm going to call this the... Um, I'm going to call this the Idiot Special. Wait, I have a better name. We have the Special Idiot. Excellent. So, um, well, they have lots of things here. I think the Special Idiot can go where Point Defense is. It's cool, excellent. So, can we turn you into another Special Idiot? We can! We have multiple Special Idiots. Wait. But, but, but. What? Nani? I don't understand. What? N -n 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 Nani? Where's all my guns? Damn it. Alright, let's go and... Um... Uh, well, we don't need that much now. What can we do here? We have one of these. Cool. We don't need safety overrides then. We can get that much without it. Last. All right, so, well, our flux per second is actually really high. So if we go with safety overrides, that means that the uh, main gun can fire more often, uh, which could work out for us. So we'll have uh, him just do his thing. And um, let's see, what can we put here? Ballistics. Cool, I guess. Let's go ahead and uh, put another auto cannon on. We don't have another auto cannon. Sounds good. Let's put a lead auto cannon on it. And then what else can we throw on here? We could throw reapers on. Our our fleet of of terrible ships is slowly growing. So, oh, hello. Soon we will have all the terrible ships of garbage. So, let's just go ahead and have you hit like a truck, why don't we? And what about you? You're anti-shield. What else is anti-shield? Rail guns, you say? Well, I'm definitely interested. What's your damage per second? 167. What's yours? Lower. Rail guns it is. Let's go ahead and, uh, how much flux do we need for all this to fire at once? 180. Well, there you go. All right, then. <laughs> we can keep our shields up forever and just keep firing. All right, let's go ahead and take the buffalo, put it back here. And um, let's put you in charge of the other happy idiot. Oh, yes, and you can level up. What are you good at? That, that, no, no. All right, well, she might end up being our carrier commander. Who knows? We might have a pet carrier following us around. And while we are waiting for all of that, we know that this bounty is still good for um, 12 more days. Let's go get in the fight, shall we? Away we go, over to that other jump point again. Maybe we will find some happy idiots to fight. If we're lucky. Alright, let's use our ping here, shall we? when we get a little bit closer to the jump point. And uh, I think it's ready. So douchebag! There's one over there. At least that we can see. Let's see if he's willing to come in and play. Hmm, douchebag! All right, so he's over there. Let's see if we can catch him before the... Oh no, he's trying to run away. Well, we don't want him to run away, do we? So let's go and try to follow him a little bit in the hopes that we can catch him. Oh no, that's... Oh. Well then, hello, friend. Oh, hello, you poor person. Well, let's go ahead and kill them, shall we? This is my commission, not your commission. Let's have... That's overkill. Extreme overkill, I might say. Let's have them go and fight. How much does it cost? So it's five for me. It's two for you because you're garbage. 
It's one for you, and one for you, and one for you. My goodness. There we go. That is the equivalent of one of my ships. Alright, good enough. I guess I'll fly one of the scouts. Uh, whatever they're on. Uh, you, I guess. What, what do you have? Where are my ships? Where are they? Right. So what do you get at? Come on, what do we see? Uh, harpoon and sepet. And over here, what do you have? Too small, we have... Nothing? Did we literally put nothing on you? Uh, oh, you have no armaments. Great. <laughs> Fantastic. Um, you, oh wait, no, you have armaments. Cool. Let's go ahead and um, shoot you a bunch. So the railgun, let's put that on auto fire. And we're going to want the sabots to do a decent job. What is our special? I don't even know. Oh no, that's not good. Ow! Well, we did our we did our best. Maybe we'll get it back. Um, let's pilot you. What is the button to pilot? X? Yes. Alright, let's fly over from our destroyed ship. And let's go ahead and kill you, shall we? My shield's back up. Now he's going to vent. Don't want him to vent. That's not good. Damn it! Alright, fuck this. Let's send in my actual wolf. Not that any of these ships matter. We just hired a bunch of crew. So let's go fly my actual ship. And then we'll eventually go get a phase ship. That will actually be good at what it does. Aren't those supposed to be out of fire? Come on, let's kill him. Very nice. And very good. Let's go kill the other one now. That the other two ships are sort of just floating around. So let's speed up and rush over there. Okay, so that's, uh, this one is having problems. So let's go ahead and get over there and kill this thing. Very nice. And let's go fight him. Goodbye, boy. Excellent. Let's go claim victory. Let's consider ship recovery. Let's get those ships back. We lost a, a, uh... Oh no, we lost too much crew. Alas. Let's, um... Mothball you then. Oh, did we get both the wolves? Well, that is, um... Good enough, I guess. 
Um, okay, so we'll put you and we'll put our officer in charge of one of these. Probably you. There. Now let's make our way back to Jungalla, where we will hopefully be able to repair a lot of our stuff. Let's go ahead and put this on his. So now that applies to maintenance cost as well. So now they cost less maintenance. Excellent. So we killed a bunch of pirates and we just made a ton of money on that monthly income. So that's good at least with our everything. All right, so let's see what we can do over here. So let's open trade. We have a bunch of crappy metals that we don't want, so let's get rid of those. And uh, what else do we have? Makeshift shield generator. Yeah, sure, we will, no. No, 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 no. They have those exp Damn. They don't have that uh, hanger. Uh, they don't have that improvised hanger anymore. Blast. All right, so. We don't want to get rid of our weapons just yet, so we're going to want around 100 supplies. That'll work. And how much fuel are we going to need to make it to other places? Ah, who cares? We know that Calzadon usually wants something. We know that Epiphany really likes its drugs, so we're going to do that. But we also know that these guys will pay a ton of money for supplies. Unfortunately, we are going to need lots of fuel to do those. So, in order to make money, we need to spend money. In order to spend money, we need to make money. In order to make money, we need to spend money. You know how this goes. Now, we have those ships that we would like to re... We have these. So let's try to make you a happy idiot as well. Uh, well, you're the pirate version, so you're subpar. Let's put that on there, and let's, you yeah, I guess we'll do that, and you, um, well you're the pirate version as well. So I guess we will also give you a seven. Yeah, the safety overrides, I guess they'll work. Alright, so, this thing's a piece of crap, but you know what, it does the job. This thing is also kind of a piece of crap, but you know what? It does the job. <laughs> now let's go ahead and do that instead. Now let's adjust their weapons groups. You can just auto it. Good enough. Good enough. And good enough. Wait. Yes, that's right. Good enough. Let's go ahead and uh, unmothball you. Now we don't have enough crew strength. Alas! So let's buy some more, let's buy, I mean, let's hire some more employees. So we need 107, so let's go up to 120-ish. Cool, sounds good. What can we buy in terms of fuel tankers? We could buy a Phaeton, but that's a bit overkill for us right now. A Dram will do the trick. Do they have any cheap Drams? Been, uh, they've been bumped, they've been beat up a little bit. You get a Gemini, not going to be worth it though. Uh, looks like the dram it will be holds 300 fuel we aren't going to spend that much fuel traveling because officer we are traveling we are not flying we are traveling please don't arrest us and um let's see what we can do so it is a civilian grade hull if we militarize its subsystems penalties uh, well let's see what happens can we mix these things Maintenance supply and then militarized subsystems. So, does that make it to where it still has greatly increased? Um, okay, so the maintenance is still just two. What happens if we get rid of this? Does the maintenance go up? It should. Yes, it does. Alright, so as long as we have militarized subsystems, we can slap all those on there. So, looks good to me. Auxiliary fuel tanks. And what else can we do? Expanded cargo holds. Oh, I see. So it increases it by 30. 
people or very oh 30% whatever's higher that means this currently holds what uh, an extra 90 yes excellent that I like so let's do that and I guess we will give it reinforced bulkheads just in case it gets blown up and um, what else can we do uh, blast doors no can make it go faster. It is kind of red already. It does have shields, so that's good. Let's go ahead and just max out its defenses like that, I suppose. And, um, okay, sounds good. The only thing we could possibly need now is, like, a nebula for marines. Can we buy a nebula? We can. But that's a bit much. Can we buy a mud skipper instead? Yes, we can. How much does that hold? A hundred people. How much does this hold? Four hundred people. That means four hundred marines versus a hundred marines. Hmm. Well, either one could be profitable, I suppose. But the more marines, the better. We can't really afford this, right? So we're going to one, and we also can hold sort of a lot of people. Let's go ahead and buy this Mudskipper, and let's see if we can crew it. We seem to be able to. Let's do extra berthing and militarized subsystems so we can fit even more people on there. Excellent. Let's go ahead and give it all the stuff, and uh, let's see. What can it do? It can hold 130 people. Sounds good. All right, so. All right. So that's going to be our stuff. Now, can we hire a bunch of you? They're cheap, actually. So we can hire a bunch of them. So we have 200 Marines. And you know what that means, right, ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, freaks of all ages. We're getting ready to go and do some raiding. Well, we'll probably lose horribly, but nobody needs to know that. Let's make... Let's buy a bunch of fuel... Yeah, that should be fine. And let's let's go get in some scrapes with uh, those pirates over here. Oh, what's this? It's a detachment. Holy crap! It's probably killing everything there. And I heard someone come in, so I'm rather skeptical of my long-term survival. I will take it. Uh, but let's mothball us. But now we can't emergency burn. Damn! We need to buy more people. I mean, we need to hire more people. So let's hire some new employees. How many do we need? Well, let's unmuffle all this first. And then let's make it something. Uh, you. Okay, sounds good. <laughs> good enough. Let's go with how many? Oh, we, oh yeah, that's fine. We can take more employees. How do we need? Say we go up to an extra twenty or so employees, and it seems last. So you need an extra like twenty or so employees, and then a few more marines. We'll take it. Now we need to repair our stuff, and let's go do a nice little raid against these bloody pirates. Alright, let's let's do our test to see if there's any enemies. Douchebag! There are no enemies. Alright, let's raid them. It's 70% effective. Amazing. Let's launch our raid. They hate us. Alright, we've gotten drugs and a makeshift shield generator. Well, we will take it. Douchebag! Didn't see anyone. Wait, carrying a lot of food. Alright, it's been a day or so, and let's see what we can do here. And increased defended preparedness. Well, we're just going to wait a little bit, maybe an extra day or so, and then let's try it again. Okay. Oh, they're not prepared now. Oh, well, what do you know? Let's launch a raid. Ah, excellent. Oh, thank you. 
Wait, that didn't take anything. Blast. Let's take everything. Oh no. We have more salvage than we can carry. What's the most cost ineffective thing here? Well, technically the drugs, because it'll just get confiscated from us. Um, but they didn't care about what we were doing last time, so I guess that's the least cost effective right now. So, well, Garner wants those, but you know, Garner were currently sacking, so of course they'd want a lot. All right, let's go ahead and do that. And um, yeah, I guess while we wait, let's uh, leave and make our way back to a jungle where we will uh, we will take our buffalo and put some hangers on it and then use it in battle because that's a good idea right guys come on right 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 please all right so we have our buffalo and we're looking at this and saying oh man that thing it's so defenseless whatever could it do in battle and then we say well we could put uh, some fighter bays in it What's the biggest, meanest, nastiest thing we can put on this thing? It literally cannot afford to have these. So, let's see. It could put a uh, put a gladius on it. We have some gladii. They're mean. Hmm. Let's do some gladii. And then let's. It has shields, so that's good enough. Right. What about you? You're too small to have um, anything like that. Wait, let's go back here. What can we do? Let's get rid of that for a second. If we do military subsystems and then additional expanded cargo holds, ah, we can fit a lot more in. Right? You're on, right? I, I, I don't understand. Is it on? No, it's not. What's wrong? Why can't we do... What? Oh, it's built in. What am I doing? So, we have the converted hangar. We have the expanded cargo holds. Excellent. So what can we put on now? Uh, talons. Good enough. And now we have five points to put on uh, something. So I guess we'll just... <laughs> we could put an antimatter blaster on there, but that'll be absolutely useless. Let's just put capacitors on. Excellent. We now have our battle buffalo. <laughs> it's absolutely useless in combat, except for its fighters. All right, so we are under crew strength, unfortunately. We need to hire more employees, so let's hire a few more employees. Oh, we can. Is five going to do it? I will actually do it. There. We are no longer under crew strength. You know what that means, right? Ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, freaks of all ages. That means we are... That we... Okay, we went with extra expanded curve holds. Okay, cool. And uh, additional birthing. All right. You know what that means, right? Ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, freaks of all ages. We are going to douche So we're going to just continue trying to attack these people. So hello. We like your stuff. It looks amazing to us. We'll take it. Oh, what's this? Heavy armor. Well, we want it. Thank you very much. You can keep that. All right. So, let's learn this. I like it. And uh, let's not sit on them, I suppose. All right. Let's raid them again. Well, what can I learn about them? Stability is currently zero. <laughs> Excellent. Their, their unrest is negative seven. <laughs> if we keep raiding them, we'll probably kill them. Which could be a problem. All right, so we don't want to kill them. Oh no, you're pursuing us. Yes, you can scan us. We're only raiding the pirates. Is it still against the law if we're killing pirates? Maybe. All right, let's go and just sell this stuff to get rid of it. And let's keep everything else because we're greedy. All right, so what can we get here? Uh, nothing that we really care about, I think. Good. 
Oopsus. Warthogs. They use light mortars. I like it. I like it. And if we were to go over here, we, we, we can't fit the, more, the Warthogs on there. They cost 18. So it would cost everything. No expanded cargo holds for us. That would make them better in combat, right? Oh, wait. That would make them better in combat, though, right? Eh. Don't worry about it. Let's go the expanded cargo holds and just put that on there. All right, let's get out of here and make our way somewhere else. So we have some supplies that we would like to sell to someone. And we have a lot of fuel. So if we went and sold to Casadon and Epiphany, we can make a lot of money. Where can we buy supplies for cheap? We can buy supplies for cheap at Goulon. And uh, Nova Maxios isn't on there. Well, how cheap are supplies here? They're actually not too bad. Let's just... Uh, let's just uh, see what we can do. Excellent. What else can we do? Alright. We'll sell like, I don't know, uh, 200 supplies at Casadon to make ourselves a bunch of money. But now we need to run for our lives because the cops are currently coming for us. They're currently demanding that we stop resisting. And, uh, uh, well, we, we want to keep resisting. So let's see, bounties, no bounties, no system bounties at least. Let's leave, let's turn off our transmitter, and now we're in hyperspace. We are using a decent amount of fuel every day, 22 fuel. Oh no, the hegemony, they like us slightly less. Don't worry, they'll hate us soon. So let's go over here and let's see what we can do at Casa Don. Uh -huh. Let's turn our transponder off. Let's keep it off, I suppose. And let's try to sneak our way over to Casa... To run for our lives. You can't catch me. Ah, good. Let's uh, keep going back, I suppose. And now let's try to disappear. Then we'll make the, uh, the castle run in 12 light years. <laughs> All right, let's let's see what we can do here. Can we get in without being caught by these douchebags? I think another one of them showed up too. Oh no, another one did show up. Let's see what we can do. Uh, all right, let's let's sell everything we can to them. For well, I'm not going to sell you all of that. So we'll sell two. Uh, we'll sell about two hundred of these. Ah. Uh, that nice money. And let's hire a bunch of, uh, well, let's sell them our Marines as well. Why not? See you guys. Thanks for all the money. And now we have a bunch of money to play around with. I think we have enough to potentially go and f start our first colony. Well, that's fast. Let's run. Maybe we can escape in, uh, 12 light seconds. Oh no. Alright, maybe we can get out of here. Stay away from me. Don't touch me. Ah, good. So, where can we go? So, the independents are there. They hate us. The independents are there. They hate us. The independents are there. They hate us. And what about here and here? Okay. So those... Ooh, oh, well, you're personally... Let's see, what do we have? The independents, they hate us. Let's go over here, and what? What planets would be good to colonize here? Uh, that one's controlled by the hegemony, and these are all pretty bad. What about this one? You're controlled by the hegemony. You have some, you have stuff. Wait, what's this? Oh, widespread ruins, I might take it. You control that, and well, all right then. I guess since we're going to be making drugs as our principal form of income, 
we will uh, see what we can do. Of course, the hegemony is probably going to waggle its finger at us and say, don't make drugs, but, well, you got to do what you got to do, right? So let's go ahead and go here. <laughs> because why not? Um, well, what's over here? They are... All right. Well, this one is under the control of multiple factions, right? Yes, the independents are over there. And they hate us. But they will hate us. So I guess here to... We could do tech mining here, but uh, we don't want to make the and we don't want to make the hegemony angry with us. So let's go here instead, and yeah, I suppose let's do that. Alternatively, we could just fight the independents and hope for the best. But I'm not too sure how well that will work. So let's go here instead. It's an easy place to get fuel from, and hopefully we will be able to make a lot of money. So we don't have a lot of cash, unfortunately. So we will spend the majority of our time probably ferrying marines back and forth to uh, Sindria and... not Sindria. Or we'll probably ferry marines to uh, several groups. To Calçadon and um, Coulon. Let's turn the transponder on so they don't immediately hate us. And let's go over here. So, on the bright side, Daddy Hegemony says you can make your, you can put your stuff there. On the downside, when they stop liking us, we're going to have problems. So, we're going to need 100 heavy machinery and more supplies and more people. All right, sounds good. So, we need to go to Nachateca. And we need to tell them we need to hire a lot of people. Of course, their response is probably going to be a middle finger. So what can we do here? Uh, well, we're going to need a lot of supplies. And we're going to need a lot of everything. Now, fortunately, we can buy fuel here dirt cheap. So I guess we can do that. And then we're going to need a lot of supplies. So I guess we can do that. We're going to need a lot of Marines. So, as you can guess, I guess we can do that. Let's see what else we can do. So, Castle Dawn wants that. Epiphany wants lots of drugs, though. We can buy drugs cheap. So, let's... Let's buy all that. And how much will that cost? Not a lot. Now let's get scanned. Thanks, guys. Now let's buy all the drugs because they aren't particularly smart about that. So we have lots of drugs now, and now I hope we are fortunate enough to run away before they try to scan us again. Okay, sounds good. Let's make our way over to uh, Majek, I suppose, at Nivemaxios, and see what we can do over here. Don't come after me, you douchebags. Stay with me. Stay away. All right, so, any douchebags over here? No. Excellent, let's leave. We will try to have our first colony up by the end of the episode. Ooh, those guys. They gave me quite the fright. And what can we do here? So we can, we can carry a lot more drugs. We need all the space heroin. Ah, well, you guys are friendly? Uh, then we're cool, I guess. All right, so the Persian League, they only sort of hate us. Sounds good. Let's jump in to Nova Mexios and let's try to buy all of the drugs. Hey guys, what's up? We want all of your drugs. Ah, but we only need, we don't need that many. So what else can we do? Let's buy your supplies. What else can we take? Let's buy your fuel. Excellent. Let's buy your marine. Your one marine. 
All right, and let's see, what else can we do? I think that's about it. Let's leave and go to Algever, where we will then sell lots and lots of drugs to a bunch of cracked out religious fanatics who want to be in the ship that's exploding while they scream, let us great. So I guess we could grant them their wish. All right, let's try to sneak in to Epiphany and hopefully not get caught by a bunch of religious fanatics. They really want us to, they really want you to know that lead is great. Oh, don't come near me. Douchebag. Okay. Seems to be keeping his distance a little bit. Maybe I'm too big. Am I too big to come after? I am evidently not too big to come after. Hey dude, if you want to fight, let's fight. Otherwise, get away from me. Okay, very nice. Do you want to fight? If, if so, let's fight. If you want to come through fight, let's come through fight. All right, so let's sell all the drugs. Let's sell, I don't know, like oh, about 100 fuel or something. Yeah, that should be fine. And then let's sell all but 50 or so supplies. Very nice. And then let's sell a bunch of marines. Who will buy? Eh, whatever, you can have them. All right, and like that, we've made a bunch of money. What else can we buy? Nothing that we don't already have. What can we buy from you? Because we're gonna need lots of people. We're gonna need a thousand employees to come down to this place for us. And unfortunately, we can't carry that many. But we could buy some really jacked up mud skippers. Okay, bad at storage, don't really care. And bad injector, so you, you go slow. What about you? Uh, increased maintenance, compromised storage. Um, well, you go slow too. What about you? You go slow. Blast! All right, what can we do over here? Nothing. All right, sounds good. Well, I guess we'll leave. And let's uh, run for our lives. Excellent. Let's make our way back to uh, Majek, I suppose. Let's go back to Nova Maxios, where we will hopefully be able to get more stuff. Oh, stay away from us. You're terrifying and dangerous. Stay away from me. Alright, so, what can we find here? Let's, let's turn that transponder on and let's make our way over to Nova Maxios. Where we will have a sudden scare as somebody comes out of nowhere. My heart skips a beat and like explodes in my chest. Alright, so, what can we hire here? Hmm. 400, so that means this would become a maximum crew of 520. We would need two nebulae. We could just do two nebulae, that's, per that's perfectly fine with me. Um, yeah, that should be fine. Well, can we get one off the black market? No. How fast does it go? Eight. Bah. What can we do here to speed the... Wait, we could militarize the subsystems. That would speed it up to nine, which is what our current max speed is. So let's go ahead and uh, buy it, I guess. So we need one of these. And we're very close. We just need a little bit more. We need another mud skipper. We can get another buffalo and carry more stuff. But let's see what we can buy. So what can we buy off your black market? Supplies and fuel. We can't find we can't buy employees right now. But let's go over here to this and say, okay, what is a terrible idea? Well first off, let's give it an improvised hangar. And let's also do the thing where we militarize it and then increase its birthing. Excellent. Now, what, what's the biggest, what's the biggest, baddest, meanest spider we can put on it? Um, 
Well, all right then. We can put some talons on. <laughs> Sounds good. Alternatively, we could do nothing else. Cool. Sounds good. Let's put talons on, I guess. We can spend 10 points. What's on you? Talons? Oh, I guess talons it is. Talons. So, um, have some capacitors, I guess. So, alright, we have these really crappy ships. We're gonna need some new employees, so let's hire some new employees. Let's hire just the bare minimum to get everything going. Alright. Then we're going to want to go to Casadon and hire as many employees as we can get. Now, Calcedon wants lots of supplies. We have lots of supplies, I think. But we're going to need more than just that. If we can hire lots of marines, that we could sell for a large profit at Calcedon. So we're going to hire all the marines we can here. And then we're going to just make our way around hiring all the people we possibly can. We're fine? Yes, we're fine. Let's go now to the Gantas Den and hopefully... Well... Eh... Let's go to Tibicina. Okay, we're not at war. No, let's not go to Tibicina. Let's instead run away. Because they are... Oh, stay with me. Okay, let's let's not go in there. Let's um are we at war with uh with with Kanan? Do they hit us too? Uh let's see, the Ludic Church. They don't hit us. Excellent. To uh Kanan we go then. Let's go to Asher. What is Asher known for? Uh, I don't know. Alright. I don't think we need to hide anymore. So the Cinder and Nyktat, they're at war now with the Hegemony. Hegemony, can you please stop being at war with everyone? Are you, are you making me paranoid? Let's jump into Gad and let's turn on our transponder. Let's run away from these Ludic Path religious fanatics. Get away from me. Okay, well, whoever that was, they evidently did not appreciate. Is that is that neutral a little red to you? Because it seems a little red to me. So let's see what we can do here. So we can buy supplies, we can buy fuel, we can buy marines. Crew is expensive, so we're not going to buy crew here. What can we do? Expanded mags, expanded missile racks. Wait, where'd it go? Oh, there it is. We'll take it. Okay, what else can we find? Uh, extend shields. Right, we probably don't need that. But I have a feeling that religious fanatic is going to come after us. Excellent. We get away. How many supplies do we have? 604. Well, we don't want to sell, we don't want to buy all of those. So let's go over to Gilead Station. And let's see what we can find over here. The religious fanatics are coming after us. They want our blood. They're begging for it. You can just hear them chanting, Lud is great, Lud is great, Lud is... Well, at least that isn't them. So let's buy some more supplies. And let's buy more fuel. Let's buy... Uh, well... Let's buy supplies. I think we're full on fuel, actually, yes. Let's hire lots of marines. And... Alright. We have enough. We have all the marines we need. Can we hire another nebula? And if they do have another one, we can't afford it. So it doesn't matter. Let's go to... Casadon. Let's run for our lives. Ah, stay with me. Stay with me. Yes, you church watchers. 
All right, so his Brazil has a system bounty, but unfortunately we are poor with his Brazil. So it would be a terrible idea, a tragedy of ideas, to go anywhere near that. So, okay, we have our two mini carriers here. And uh, what else can we do? Let's try to slip in and let's see. That should work. Because we're going to have a colony very soon, I hope. You, oh, you're just a traitor. You traitor. Alright. Douchebag! Oh no, this douchebag is coming for me. Let's try to run. Stay with me, you douchebag. If I have to fight you, I won't be able to sell anything over there. I can fight you afterwards, though. That should be fun. But right now, I need to not kill anybody. So I need to hide. And sneak. And slink and hope that I can... Ah, good. Have this patrol over there. It's going over that way. Let's try to slink over. Ah! Right, there he goes. Oh no, he saw me. Alright, here's a chance. Let's try to slink in. Crap. You bastards. All right, in we go. Let's dive. All right, so we need to sell all the Marines. Uh, well, I'm not going to sell you, but let's sell 600 supplies. And you want a lot of fuel. Well, I don't feel like parting with that fuel, unfortunately. And what else can we do here? Do you have a nebula I can take from you? No. You don't. You're useless to me. Do you have any weapons that I might want? No. Do you have anything else I might want? Expanded magazines? That could be good. Um, well, I don't think you have anything that I'm after at the moment. But I do need to... Oh, yes, crew. That's right. Ah. Oh. No. Ah, oh, yes. So let's take that and then let's run for our lives because they're going to be coming for us all right i guess they're not going to be coming for us Barbara. so let's go ahead and slink out of here then they're not coming to get us Barbara. so let's leave and uh, let's see what we can find over here no traders coming for us no no one coming for us stay with me don't touch me all right, let's make our way over to Hegemony Space, where we know we're not surrounded by people who want to kill us. And uh, I don't think they had another. So Duzak is in... We don't know anything about Duzak. Let's go over to Citadel Arcadia, which is the, as we found out last time, one of the least well-defended citadels of all time. By the way, if you're not, if you don't know what a citadel is, just, you know, so you can be an interesting person. A citadel is the in is the innermost part of a castle. I think. So it's like you have the walls and then the castle walls are there. And then you have usually an inner wall. And then you have the big fortress in the middle. That's the citadel. I think. Maybe. Probably. We'll figure it out. So what can we do here? Can we get another nebula? We can get another nebula. All right, we can now afford, we can now get as many employees as we need. You guys are expensive here, but we want to do this quickly. So we need... Ah! We're going to need more than that, unfortunately. Um, right. We're also going to need 100 heavy machinery, so let's just buy what you have on the black market. Uh, we'll need supplies, so I guess we'll take supplies too. And let's repair our ships. Oh, that's right, we have that new nebula. So what can we put on you? Um, let's name this um, Crap Carrier. All right, sounds good. So, yeah, the Crap Carrier's over there. What can we put you in? Okay, we have the Crap Carrier as well. And 
Right. Uh, right. Well, the only thing we can afford is uh, Talons right now. So Talons it is. And now let's run for our lives. Let's run for our lives to Agrius. Because we don't have anything illegal, right? Yes, you can scan us. Alright, so let's trade with these guys. We need more douchebags, so we want them on the black market. And um, we need 1,250 or so. Yeah, that's fine. Alright, we have enough employees, and we need more heavy machinery, which we can get ample of here. So we'll just take 100. Let's go and get that so we can get 150 so that one guy stops yelling at me. <laughs> Stop selling your equipment, he yells. Alright, so we can now make our way to this one place in Naraka. That is hopefully not the absolute worst. Let's go there. Well, let's go there instead so we can at least do some mining. And off we go to found our very first colony, our premier colony. Let's make daddy angry. He's coming for us. All right, well, he's sending his, he's sending his minions after us. All right, off we go to, to establish our very first colony. Holy crap, that's, ima that's enormous. Uh, we don't want to be anywhere near that. Wait, that, ah! Stay with me. Let's turn our transponder on. And um, he's going to immediately get jumped. Right, so. Establish a colony. This one is claimed by the hedge money, but as a commission holder, you'll be allowed to establish a colony here. Well, we could do minerals and um, drugs. Man, a military base. So we're going to go with um, Whiskey Primus. Right. Whiskey Primus it is. We have something that looks like whiskey. Oh, there's more? I didn't realize there were more. Um, let's see. Well, this sort of looks like a cup, right? <laughs> let's see. Um, What can we do here? Um, I got it. Let's go with that one. So this is literally looking down the uh, cup of a, a cup of some of a whiskey bottle, of a whiskey cup, and um, Tango Company, the whiskey company. Yes, there we go. We're soon to be dead. So, the whiskey company, yes. Uh, right. Uh, w what's a brand of whiskey? Um, let me see if I can find something here. What is a type of whiskey? That. As I check on my phone real quick, because I didn't think about this ahead of time. Um, let's see, uh, types of whiskey and um, right we'll have to really badly try to misspell it but uh, it's a bourbon <laughs> all right we'll do it excellent now what can we do here um drugs what else can we do here oh uh, freeport oh can't do a freeport yet. Alas. But, um. No, we don't want to hire more Marines. Let's see. What can we leave here? All this stuff. You call us 10. Okay. Alright, so we have everything we need there. Very nice. Now let's, um. Wait for. D well, we can't afford to build anything else. We need to go and, um. 
do stuff. But on the bright side, our drugs will immediately start making us money. So guys, we have started Light Industry. We are going to make lots of drugs. And, um... Yeah. Ah! No! Give me my money back. You know, I can't afford that. So... <laughs> we could abandon it immediately and, uh... Not have problems. But, uh, okay, well... Whiskey Primus is off of the boat. Off the boat is off the ground. And uh, we're going to enjoy trying to desperately descend it from people who are looking at our drug production and saying, hey, you, stop that. All right. With that, everyone, thank you for watching. And have a good night or a good day or good whatever. My name has been Finmer. This has been Star Sector Whiskey Bravo. Whiskey Tango. And if you like the video, like it, comment below, tell me if you think this is going to be hilarious or really stupid. Uh, probably both, it'll be hilarious either way. Comment, subscribe, ring that bell, and share with your friends, share on social media, share wherever you want to share with anybody who you think might be interested or entertained by this. And I will see you guys next time. Bye.